Season 2! Mob Psycho is back, baby! Welcome back to the channel. We have episode 1 of Season 2 called Ripped Apart Someone Is Watching. I see we're keeping the format of the title. Season 1 of Mob Psycho 100 was uh, surprising how, how impressive it was to me. In terms of the story, the animation, everything, I don't think it blew me out of the water by any means, but Mob is just such a likable MC, and the entire cast is just well-made and really flows together. I'm excited to see how we kick off this new season. If you're new to the channel, drop a sub and hit that big boy bell, and let's get started. Wait, this is this is the place where season one started. Is it just re-explaining how the world works? I honestly thought we would end up in this place at the end of season one. Espas. Oh, psychics. Kind of the same, right? A ghost haunting a farm? Well, that looks like a goddamn tornado. Three years? Creep you out, bro. I mean, I guess he said it's just for fun. This is Reagan, isn't it? Oh my God. I hope mom is here. Your problem ain't getting solved. He's too expensive. Bro, look, he's got a hole in his sock. I do too. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Oh my gosh! We're on contractual obligations! Veggies as payment. What's my- There he is! There's the boy! <laughs> what if any time has passed by between now and season one? The scarecrow! Oh, that's what it's like taking the form of? It's kind of ironic because the scarecrow is supposed to like protect the farm. It's gonna be light work, baby. Oh. Oh, like how Dimple takes over people? Oh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> no, Reagan! Wriggle, wriggle. <laughs> Show me the deed. Bro, is that Luffy? He just drains it from the plants. He's just a parasite. Blast him. Dog, if anything ever happens to Reagan or Mob, I will be just so... It'll, it'll destroy me. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it's endless. This is one of the creepier, uh, uh, like, curses or spirits that we've come across. Like, look at it, man! It looks like the chocolate lady from SpongeBob! Ways to destroy it. Oh. Controlling living things. Mob's getting dragged down! Wait. Control a living thing? Wait, he controlled it? Like, took over where it... it is it like kind of like possessing? Oh. I feel like Mob just power spiked like crazy. Overwrite my command. Ew. Now Mob has all the vines. <laughs> He's the plant king. The Dunzo part two. Oh, nothing but a seed. That inspired him to start a home garden. He just gave him a bunch of, like, starter equipment. What's his pay? Ain't no way. And Mob just thanks him. Oh, like, that's like a life hack, bro. Just insta, insta growth. Oh my gosh. They could be rich, man. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, he's gonna use Mob even more. Unless they taste bad. Oh. Umami? Zero percent. Oh, yeah, you can't use, uh, you can't use magic or, or anything to everything to fix every problem. All right, we got a new intro. This has the same energy as the first one. There's the broccoli again. Oh, dude, the gang. Was this Teru's hair go back tonight? It is. Teru's hair is back. Oh, we got all the young espers. We actually have like a, a cast now from everyone we met. <laughs> Body Improvement Club! Oh, Claw? More Claw? I think Claw is going to be the overarching enemy over all three seasons. This is a jammer. I look like Golden, bro. Life is your own. 
Dude, that was a jammer. Season one was good. That, that knocked it out of the park. Holy. We're looking for our god. Wait, what? We're looking for mob? Psycho helmet religion? That's mob. Doesn't she know where he is at school, though? She's playing them, man. Yeah, mob wouldn't want to do that. Bro, mob just gets used by people. Huh? Oh, shoot. Wow, he's admitting to it all. I respect it. I respect it. The redemption. Mob as, as like student council president? Absolutely no way. Aww. Subami-chan. <laughs> yeah, it's so not obvious. Hey, it's just how childhood goes, man. You drift apart. I think he has a chance with her. Now, will he, though? Will that be enough to convince him? I think they could get enough people to vote for him, too. Like, the Body Improvement Club, he's got people behind him. This is nerve-wracking. He's gonna do it! Let's go, Mob! I don't think he has to do all this to get her attention, but he's breaking out of his shell. Oh, wow, that was a very quick montage. Wait, he's rerunning? Oh, like they took more of the fall too. Oh, he's saying he was taking responsibility. Now he's gonna see if they'll elect him again. Give your heart. <laughs> Let's go, Bob. He's got my vote. <gasps> she sees him. I like how they're all sitting the same way. Yeah! See, I said he's got the body improvement club behind him. Come on, buddy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Five minutes. He sat there in silence for five minutes? No, he got last place. I'm gonna cry, bro. There's no way. There's no way he's trying. Oh, it's not that one guy. Uh, what's his name? Oh. Oh my gosh! Task failed successfully! Ew! He's in! Aww. W wingman. <laughs> Super natural. I love when they're drawn like so drastically. Aww, he got himself a girl! An acquaintance. Just tell her, Mob. It'll be a chick magnet. I guarantee it. She's so interested in him. Yeah, no, for real. No, you gotta be yourself. Oh, no. Oh, this is so damn adorable! She was, like, embarrassed at first. He has to be honest with her, man. Emmy, okay. He's gonna go back for body improvement club? You want to tell him just to walk home with her? Jesus! <laughs> As if. Oh my god, he hit the door frame. He knows. He knows. He feels so happy. Surely this doesn't go horribly wrong. One week later. Oh my gosh. So much has happened in this first episode. He's reading it. Her novel. You know a lot of big words. Oh. No, that's not what he meant. Oh man. He's just awkward. No, stop! I mean, kind of, yeah, but... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. This is so sad.
I think he took her words more to heart, though, that he doesn't live for himself. <laughs> She's downplaying it around her friends. <gasps> <gasps> These bitches. I'm sorry, they're children. True, spit, mob. Spit. She's afraid to be herself. He's gonna pick it all up. This is so my god. He's crying. Oh my god. <laughs> Why is this so sad? No going back. <gasps> Wait, can he? He's gonna bring all. Oh my gosh. Wait, one piece is missing. <gasps> no, there it is. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's so smooth. Oh my gosh. That was so. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, for real. He doesn't just use his powers like that. <laughs> oh, shoot. She's gonna write a story. It was a real one this... Well, no, I guess it wasn't a real one this time. It seemed real. Oh, no. Dimple. <laughs> but I knew that. Wait, what person? Wait, where's 27 percent? Bro, that first. How am I? How am I like, brought to tears in the first episode of the season? I mean, Mob talking to a girl like that and the development of his relationship with her over the course of one episode. It was done so well. And I didn't even really realize it till after after like Dimple brought it up. But it is rare for him to just use his powers like that. Like when Reagan isn't telling him to. But I like how this first episode kind of reestablished the world, reestablished literally like most of the characters that we met kind of showed where everyone's at right now and while it didn't get any ball rolling in terms of like i don't think opposition or anything i think this emmy girl is going to be a uh, i would imagine a part of the main cast at this point and he caught the eye of the girl he had been wanting to this whole time suba me but guys that has been it for episode one of mob cycle 100 season two do drop a comment down below on what you thought of the episode and how it kicked off the season and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace